Mr. Azman Yahya. Can you please tell me your name? Can you switch on the video? Just want to see your face. You are the only one. Uh, yes, who is? What is your name? Af. Ini bukan Afka kan? Evanava. Yes, Bastri Patricia is joining. Okay, welcome. Uh, we have to spend some time. We have to spend some time to wait for others to come. Uh, I expect not many of you turn up, but this session is recorded, you know, for your revision, eh? You can view it when you are free, okay? So today we are just going to study on the a story from Egypt. We are going to read about the the the, the story. Then we will just answer some comprehension questions. Okay, all right. No Asmura, who is No Asmura? Evan, can you switch on your microphone or not? Because it is a habit, good habit to switch it off. To, whenever teacher want to talk to you, and then you switch it on. Okay, whenever you are not speaking, you off it. Ah, it's 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 better. If not. It is quite disturbing to have this session if everybody switch on the microphone, eh? isn't it? No Asmora, who is no Asmora? Let me see your face. Oh, Danish, Danish, I know that. Makin sehat Danish, muka jadi bulat doh. Oh, say you must be eating a lot of food now. Hari raya punya basal <laughs> Uh, then can you adjust your camera so that I can see your full face? All right. I tell you what. If you want to hide your face, it's okay. If you want, if you feel uncomfortable, you can off your camera. Up to you. Ah, uh, boleh tutup video. It's up to you. Bebas, eh? Okay. If you if you want to show your face, it's okay too. Uh, let's start our lesson. Even though there are three of you in a group. Okay, uh, even though not many of you, Amsha, welcome, Amsha. Uh, it is advisable for you to use MOE account, or MOE email to log in. I don't have to admit every time. Uh, do you know what's MOE? Minister Ministry of Education punya email account lah, digalakkan. Uh, but however, you can use Gmail account too. It's okay. It's okay. But I have to admit every time if you use Gmail account. You know what's admit? Admit means kita kena click masuk and mengganggu lah. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the zoo. Let's go. Let's go. Now I'm going to show you the story. I think you have gone through the what you call the YouTube drink, the YouTube links in uh, our our telegram chat isn't it where is it ah uh, here okay right have you gone through this one i posted just now have you gone through okay uh, i think the best is from this teacher dia mengajar dengan baik sekali eh a Malay English teacher. Okay. Afterward, we are going to do some exercise. I am not going to show you the whole uh, video because you can watch the video on your home, uh, on your own at home. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning, dear Bobby. Ah, ni cikgu tiubi go I don't know what is his name, eh? but uh, he teaches English well, and I like him very much. Okay, uh, let's go. Let's see. So for today's lesson, we will read another story, and the story is entitled The Curse. The story is from your textbook, page 30. 
So let's get started. Okay, so this is the story. Okay, this is the story from your textbook, like I mentioned just now. Okay, the title of the story is the curse. The curse. Do you know what does it mean by the curse? The curse mean in Malay we call it sumpah lah. You know it's sumpah, sumpahan lah. The ancient in ancient time, pada zaman dulu once uh, people believe in magic, magic, magic. Orang percaya kepada silap mata ni Ilmu Ilmu sihir eh. uh, Whenever you want To make people sick You say the curse You utter the curse uh, You want If you want to, to The bad thing happen to your enemy And then You will say the curse uh, Curse tu macam marah-marah orang lah Sumpah lah And then Maybe they are using some magical power to make sure that your enemy is going to suffer from the curse. Uh, curse tu macam doa. Bukan doa tu. Macam se, sumpahan lah. Maybe you understand what is it eh? The curse. Right. So, first of all, as usual, seperti biasa, uh, apa yang awak kena tahu ialah All the vocabularies, all the vocabulary mentioned here. Okay, first is treasure. Treasure ni ialah harta, 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 harta karun. Dai, dai maksudnya mati. I don't think so. I am going to show you the video because this video is going to take about 30 minutes or even more. I prefer to read it on my own. Eh? Then, if you want to do revision, you can do revision with this cikgu and some other cikgu. Eh? I'll post it here. Eh. Okay, I'm going to read it on my own. I'm still going to watch this digi. Eh. I want to read it on my own here. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, ah uh, here. Eh. Okay, treasure, harta karun as the teacher said. Die, die means pass away. Okay, die means there's no life. Gold, gold is a metal. Gold is a precious metal, very expensive metal. Mosquito, mosquito is a very dangerous insect, uh, harmful insect that carry diseases. Do you know the meaning? Do you know what type of disease the mosquito carries? Anyone? Nyamo apa? How to say it in Malay? The harmful insect mosquito. Nyamo apa? Nyamo A? Anybody? Anybody? Switch on your microphone. Nyamo A? Daddy. Daddy, yes. Who is that? Irfan, go. Uh, nyamo Edis. Okay, what type of disease that Nyamo Edis carry? That Edis mosquito carries? Can you know? Can you tell me? Penyakit apa? What type of illness? Dengue lah. Okay? Do you know how to spell dengue in English? Dengue. D E Deng. Dengue. I'm not sure I've forgotten about it. But in Malay, I know how to spell it in Malay. But in English, I have forgotten about it. Dengue. Eh? Guinea go. If you want to be a doctor, you must... I think wrong spelling. Eh? Let us check in YouTube or check in D E N G G I D E Dang Oh G G I That one is Malay. That one is Malay, my dear. Dengue is Malay. English D E N G G I G I go. Uh, it's supposed to be. This is Malay. Dalam bahasa Melayu, in English, you Dengue ah Dengue fever. U E eh? U E eh? dengue fever eh? Okay, if you want to be a doctor, you must know how to spell the word correctly, you know. The once I was asked by a kid, uh, Cerek Beret. Cerek Beret is a uh, perak jahe kan? If you eat something wrongly, okay? Cerek Beret, how do you spell, how do you say Cerek Beret in English? English you call diarrhea, no? 
Then suddenly the kids ask me how to spell diarrhea. I don't know how to spell diarrhea. <laughs> Malu. But the most difficult words to spell is diarrhea for me. D Jerek beret lah. Di Di D Y Di I D D D A H I I O R R O N I H A D A D I A R R H E A. So I think diarrhea. Jerek beret is the most difficult words for me to spell. Alright, diary, cherry berry. So if you want to be a doctor, you must know how to spell the word correctly. Dengue is D E N G U E, you know. Dengue. Ah, dengue. Dengue is the type of disease that carry by the mosquito called Aedes. Nyamo Aedes, eh? A E D E S. Go. Ah, Aedes mosquito. Ah, uh, this mosquito eh, it's normally happen in tropical countries lah. Okay, enough. Let's go and read the story on my own eh. What do you know about Tutankhamun's curse? Oh, Tutankhamun is the king of Egypt. Go. Sumpah dia eh, I'm going to read eh the curse in ancient Egypt. Mesi eh. Di negara Mesir pada zaman dahulu lah ancient Egypt eh. Now Egypt is a Islamic country eh. Previously it was not an Islamic country. It was a non-Islamic country. That they believe in all sort of gods. Eh. I don't know what the gods they are believing. Now Tutankhamun is the macam. It's a king lah. But he is not a Muslim. I think so. And 18 years old king died. Oh, 18 tahun mati dah. He died young eh. They put his body in the tomb. You know it's tomb? Tomb ni tu macam kubur lah. Graveyard lah tomb. The tomb. But there is one cartoon eh. Called the tomb of a... The tomb of a... Of unknown soldier ko. Bukan? The tomb of unknown soldier pula. The tomb, eh, tomb of what, eh? This is movie, yo. It's a type of movie, tomb what? Ah, ni, Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider. Very nice movie, eh. Kita semua ni China pun ada, oh, the tomb. Mereka curi harta benda di dalam kubur, ah. Normally people keep things, eh, precious things, treasure in the tomb, so that the tomb, see? I like this show, ah. Okay, in the tomb. Inside the tomb, there were treasure and curse. Ada harta karun ni. Dengan sumpahan dia, curse eh. Alright, you know why they put curse? They put curse ah in order to avoid people to raid the tomb, to come and steal the the treasure of the tomb eh. In 1922, 1922 is about. It's about how many years ago? Uh, it's about oh, nineteen twenty two. Uh, and then nine. It's about ninety nine years ago. Ninety nine years ago, one hundred years ago. Two Englishmen, Howard Carter and Lord Kawa Carnarvon, Carnarvon went to the valley of the king on 4th of November one of the cutters men found something oh ni eh the Englishman go into the tomb and die siapa yang masuk ke dalam kubur akan mati that one is a curse eh look sir yes at last Howard Carter and Lord Carnarvon opened the tomb the curse the curse dia kata, hey, ni orang Arab ni. Mesir. Say that, sir, sir, sir. Dia kata, sir di sini tu macam tuan lah. Macam cikgu lah. If you call someone sir means you are expecting that fella to be 
an honored person who can teach you, you know, sir. Sir, oh, macam cikgu lah, but it's not cikgu lah. Sir ni macam orang yang pandai lah. Sir, yang dihormati dalam masyarakat lah. Bukan Datuk Tan Sri lah, no. Sir is something like, but it's a type of uh, gelaran in UK, sir. Alright, now. Uh, the curse, sir, dia kata, tu, uh, sumpah tu, tuan, sumpahan tu, the curse, means uh, he's afraid of the curse. Eh. Inside the tomb, there were chairs, Boxes of food, treasures and gold. Betul lah. Ada makanan, ada harta karun, everything. Macam cerita Alibaba lah. <laughs> P. Ramli punya cerita lah. The, the mummy of Tutankhamun was there too. Mummy, do you know what's mummy you learned before, isn't it? Uh, he died 3,000 years ago. Oh, duit. 3,000 tahun yang lalu duduk situ, oh. Oh, doi. But Lord Carnarvon never saw the treasure. A mosquito beat him. Ha, ingatlah. Oh, and he died. Was it a curse? I don't think it is a curse, my dear. You know what mosquito beat Carna Lord Carnarvon? Carnarvon? Yeah, the name of the mosquito is called Nyamo Edis. Edis mosquito and it carries dengue. Dengue virus. It's not coronavirus, no. Dengue virus, no. COVID-19 virus, no. Dengue virus, eh. So that this old man, eh. This old man died because of the virus called dengue, eh. Okay, you learn something if you want to be a doctor. Do not believe in this uh, old ancient magical curse. Uh, there's no such thing. There's no such thing. Remember, we have to be calm and educated person, a modern person. Believe, believe in, believe in science and mathematics. Okay. Uh, mai kita tengok apa benda tu project work use the internet to find information about Tutankhamun select the information you think it is interesting important and use it to make powerpoint presentation no need lah no need no need we do not have the opportunity to go to school i just want you to answer some comprehension question will do jawab soalan kefahaman lah ok cukup lah do not no project for you ok setuju Setuju tak? Agree tak? Alright. Hmm. Yes. Now we are going to study a little bit. Byte. Byte is digitan lah. Do you know what is the difference between byte and bit you know? Ah. Remember. Byte. Byte is uh, every day I buy. I buy. I buy apple with my Okay, by saya gigi. Beat is past ten. Past ten tu, I beat, I beat my little brother yesterday because I was angry with him. I beat it, beat it, beat it. Gigi dia lah. <laughs> past ten is beat, you know. Yesterday the snake beat my leg. You can, you, you cannot say yesterday the snake bite my leg. Wrong, you know. Bite it means every day. Bite, bite. Tiap-tiap hari kita gigit, 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 bite. Eh. Okay. Past tense is called beat. How old was he? He was uh, 18 years old. Was. Napa lah? Was. Past tense eh. How did he die? A mosquito beat him. Mosquito beat. Not bite. Beat. Past tense. Ingat lah bite tu tiap-tiap hari kita gigit tau. Oh. I bite. My brother every day because I love him. <laughs> my younger baby, my baby bites me every day. My cat bites me every day. But a mosquito beat him. Beat. So, past ten lah. Dah lama berlaku. Okay. What was his name? Nak perhatikan past ten eh. His name was Tutankhamun. Tutankhamun. <laughs> Okay, the past tense of go is when, alright. The past tense of see is saw, uh, alright. Well, I 
I see you every day. I see my father every day. But I saw a babi hutan yesterday. I saw a boar yesterday. Okay. So, tu sesuatu yang dah berlaku. Alright. Find. Find that every day. I find. I find. I find. I found means yesterday I found. But it's a past then. Eh? Okay. Now we are going to answer the question. Eh, we are going to answer the question here. Or eh, go on. I don't know how to use my mouse. Eh, suddenly. Eh, sorry for my uh, computer. I don't know how to manipulate. I don't know how to handle it well. I have to press control in order to enlarge it. Okay, now let's go for the answer. Later on, you are going to answer it in your exercise book, eh? Jawab dalam buku tulis, eh? Tajuknya ialah... The Curse. The Curse. Okay. The answer is... The, the, the title is The Curse. Right. Today's date. Okay. And they... Okay. Start to answer. Do you know the answer? Just talk about the answer we do. Then I will... Yeah. I, I'm going to give you the choices for those people who are not so good in English. They can choose the answer and write it down. Eh? Afterward, afterward, not now. Let's talk about the answer. When did Carter, Jimmy Carter, ke? <laughs> when did Char Carter and his men find Tutankhamun's tomb? Bila mereka, bila mereka jumpa kubur dia? In 1922. Ah, in 1922. In 1922. Betul ke? Uh, but you don't say 1900. No, you say 1922. 19, 1922 eh? 1922. Betul ke? Uh, mari kita check. In China. Oh ya, yeah, in 1922. Correct lah. Pandainya anak muridku. Yeah. But you have to answer it. You have to answer it in 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 full sentence, eh? In full sentence, nama ayat ayat penuh lah. Uh, uh, okay, example, example, eh? Uh, example, he, he, and they, they, mereka ramai tu. They found to ta. Pak, ya nama dia Tuta Kamun Tom Not Tom eh. Tom tu nama orang eh. Tum 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 Not Tom Tom tu nama orang Tom Boy ke The Tom Cat ke Tum Everybody say Tum 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 Bunyinya macam Tum lah Tum eh Haa ah. Uh, they found Tutankhamun's tomb in 1922. Go. Ah, alright. Alright. Who opened the tomb? Talk about it. Who? Siapa yang buka tomb tu? I don't know the answer. Do you know the answer? Carter. Carter opened the tomb. Where is it? Carter opened the tomb. No, wrong. They go, they go. Because the tomb is very heavy, eh? The tomb was very heavy. Both of them opened the tomb. Napa? Howard Carter and Lord Carnarvon opened the tomb, eh? In fact, the British people are, for me, it is not good to open people's tomb, you know? They are considered tomb raider, so. They are criminals uh, for me <laughs> because they simply come to people's country and menjajah how you study in English and uh, study sejarah, isn't it? History. They come and colonize people's country, colonize Malaysia, and then they simply do anything they want. But they claim that they pass on knowledge to us, huh? but simply they take away our treasure. Ha, so the answer is. Howard Carter and Lord Carnarvon open the tomb. Ini dah jawapan dia, boh. Okay, right? Okay, can can we go to? Uh, can we go to the? Yes, can we go to third question? 
How old was Tutankhamun when he died? 18 years old. Yes, 18 years old. In English, proper English. He died. Dia mati eh. He died. When? He was? He was? 18 years old. Payah nak tulis dengan mouse tu. So. <laughs> I'm writing with my mouse, you know. <laughs> he died when he was 18 years old. Now, number four. What was inside the tomb? Apakah yang ada di dalam kubur tu? Ada jawapan dia. There was chairs, box of gold, and gold. Yes. Yes, clever girls, clever boy. Ni lah jawapan dia. There were chairs. <laughs> Boxes of food, treasures and gold. Okay? Alright. Now we go to the last question. How did Lord Carnarvon die? Uh -huh. um, yes. Lord... He, yes. He died. Dear Mati. He died because of because of because of mosquito bit but i teachers will be happy if you are a scientist you are modern people if you are a doctor how are you going to diagnose how are you going to how to say uh, how how are you going to tell people that he died if you are a doctor he died because of what? Mosquito bite. Mosquito bite. Oh, mosquito beat him. Mosquito bite. But the best one is he died because he has got a uh, dengue uh, virus. <laughs> because uh, Eddie's mosquito beat him and he has got a uh, dengue virus. That is what. Uh, modern people are saying a good doctor if you want to be a doctor he died because of mosquito beat and the mosquito is uh, Eddie's mosquito and it carries dengue virus oh ini lah cara doktor jawab but for you I think you are not a doctor you just say that he died because of mosquito bites or you say he died because of mosquito beat him yeah. cukup ah okay so today's homework five comprehension questions any question to ask before i stop any question to ask me my dear yes yes uh, you have to copy the question my dear you have to copy the question where is my google how many homework do you have uh, uh five question go all together okay all right so, uh, this 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 question that I just show you. Sorry, I don't know where is my Google Meet. <laughs> oh, it's here. It's here. All right, it's here. Google Meet. Uh, here. Okay. Uh, here. All right. Uh, too many, too many, <laughs> too many things that I open up in my computer. Anyway, yes, there are five questions for you to answer comprehension. Remember to copy the questions the title is the curse and answer it on your own by referring to the story if you are not so sure i give you the choices afterward check your gossip telegram okay you can choose boleh pilih jawapan okay any other okay. questions any other questions simple only we see where we are doing simple thing I'm going to say, yes, Mugri, say, just say. And do we have to um, uh, write all the, the story in the book? No, no, no. Two men told the story seems to seems too long. You want to copy the Soho story? It's up to you, but I encourage you not to do so. Because uh, copying is good. But too much copying will make you tired. <laughs> Just the question will do. Eh, salin soalan jawab. That's all. 
soalan the questions and the answer okay uh, you can even play a games eh, my dear you can even play games suggested by the malay english teacher just now okay uh, i don't know where i put it uh, you can check in your telegram okay that's all today you can even play a game some games right please let me know if you have finished your homework okay yes yeah you can snap your homework as a proof but i just afraid that people others pupils will copy your answers batisha that is the problem if you snap and post people copy you know and then they become a copycats i don't want people to become copycats how are you going to solve it okay you can pm me do you know what's pm yes but mukri just say pm means you can post personally to me not in the group understand personal ah personal ah uh, yes ah uh, direct one to one nah. then people cannot see the answer all right yeah mukri any questions all right Yes, I'm listening. I think your line is. Yes. You don't have to send to uh, your homework to me to go, but you sure you just need to. Yes. Send just your name and then make an emoji, right? And whatever, whatever. You can personal to me lah. Personal easy. Personal. I want you to be to uh, to communicate with me personally. Personal. You know, personal. Personal. WhatsApp personal ke Telegram personal ke? Okay? That's all for today. Okay. That's all for today. I'm going to leave you but I'm a captain here. I supposed to be the last to leave, you know. But if I want to leave, I have to assign. You want to chat with each other also can? I assign uh, Mukri to be the captain. I'm going to leave. Because I haven't taken my breakfast yet. You are the captain, huh? Ah, uh, okay. You can chat among yourself, preferably in English. Uh, I'm going to leave you. Mukri will be the captain. Okay, I'm going to leave this ship, this Titanic ship. Eh? Bye bye, bye bye. I love you. Study hard. <laughs>